I just bought LEDs for the bus. I don't know if they're the right size or not. Let's see if I can get it in focus. They look bigger than the ones that came out, the incandescents. I looked up T67, which is a much, much smaller bulb, but it has the same bottom. So I don't know if these are going to fit or not. I guess we'll find out when I get to the bus. There's supposed to be 10 of them, two per package. And there are. So we'll find out. Okay, we're here. The bus is at the hunt club. I'm allowed to put it here while we're working on it. I just opened the door. The fuel lines blew out. So everything's torn apart and that's being replaced. And it's all out here. And unfortunately, since everything is torn apart, there's the controls to the lights. So I'm not going to be able to test to see if they work. I can see if they fit. And uh, yes, they do. Cool. They fit just fine. No clue if they're going to work or not, though. Will that bend up in there? Nope. Huh. Oh well, at least they fit. The plan was to test and see if they work, but that's not going to happen. Hmm. Well, okay then. As you can see, nothing has been done because I am house sitting. Still needs a lot of work, but we'll get to it. The plan is to have the shower right here permanently seal that door. Have the toilet in the very back, back here where this shelf is have this open to where it can be used and where all this is well the radiator's out why is that out huh well i'm not a mechanic so i have no idea why that's out but they are mechanics so they know what they're doing I'm going to put the sink, well, the kitchen, right here. And then up front, where all these seats are, they're coming out. My friend is keeping them for his boat. He's going to re-upholster them and put them in his boat. And this entire area here is going to be my workbench for working on computers as soon as I can get back to work. And hopefully these lights work. Let me see if I can get it to focus. I can't tell if it's focused or not. Looks like it. Well, hopefully it is. Hopefully y'all can see what it's doing. Or what it is. And get all of those in there. Even with the incandescents, which are currently in there, there's one, two, three... Six. I thought there were seven, but there's only six. When you turn those on, this entire bus lights up. And I'm going to have LED strips positioned throughout to give me light also. This is an extremely bright spotlight. It was for the wheelchair door. My friend is also taking this for his boat and 
none of the speakers work. Um, we're going to trace those and make them work. This works, but the outside, I don't even know what you call it. It's one of those. It's a radiator looking thing. It's completely con corroded and just blows the Freon right out of it. And it's got to be replaced. Well, at least I know where the fuse panel is now. Cool. And that's it. This is an empty thing. I'm thinking about pulling it out or cutting it out, whichever. Using it as storage. But I'm going to need advice on that. I know that area is hollow because I've seen other buses where that has a little drawer for the, or not drawer, a door for the uh, thing telling people where the bus is going. But that's about it for now. More to come. This, by the way, is the thing I was talking about for the air conditioner. You can see down. Well, I don't know if you can see that or not. I'll know when I edit the video. But it's completely corroded and gone. And it just blows the Freon right out. So the air conditioner never gets cold. I don't know if this can be replaced or just taken out completely. I don't know. I guess I'll find out.